Bonjour, it's Pauline Ferrand Prévost. This is my journey, my jersey. So I start with cycling when I was uh, five years old. First, my mother did not want me to, to do cycling because she said that it was not for uh, girls and like not uh, feminine. She used to be a cyclist and my father had a bike shop uh, in Reims where I was living. So she put me in uh, ice uh, dance uh, skating, but yeah, it was, it was just not for me. <laughs> so yeah, I told her that I wanted to do like my uh, older brother and like my parents to do cycling. I knew I had this, you know, in my blood and it's what I wanted to do. After that, I became a professional in 2012 in the Rabobank team. And for me, it was like kind of a dream because uh, I was in the team with Marianne Voss. For me, she was like uh, an icon. She's still for me, but racing with her, it was like, um, yeah, I, I learned really a lot because she was teaching me. I can say that now I became the rider I am because, because of her. Yeah, after that I became world champion in the three disciplines and it was okay, like a bit unexpected, but I have in my head like the dream to be Olympic champion. I had already three chances and I failed the three, the three times. So now I really want to focus on Paris 2024 at home where I want to, yeah, try to win and to, to make my dreams uh, come true. So for the base of my jersey, I chose a, like a navy blue, Nautica, just because I love the initial colors of uh, our jersey uh, in the team. Yeah. I like black, but black sometimes is like too, too aggressive. And navy blue, it's like more like classy. And I find like it's, it's a really good color for, uh, for my jersey. I wanted also to, to mix with the bright color for a safety reason also. Yeah, I think it's a good mix between uh, these both colors and I really love it. It's always a nice feeling to, to race uh, for uh, this country, you know. For sure, for, uh, for everyone, it's, um, we are really proud to wear the national jersey because yeah, we want to, to be the best like for uh, the country, for the nation. And yeah, I, I love this color, you know, like blue, white, red. It's like looking so nice and um, it's why I'm so happy with the jersey we, we made. Yeah, I have won the, the three uh, titles in, on the road, on cyclocross and MTB the same year. It's funny because it's not something that I was looking for, you know. I just, I was just in super good shape and I was using this good shape to, to win races. And it came out at the end that I won, yeah, three world titles in three different disciplines. But it was not really the main goal. The main goal was like to win all the races and to just try to enjoy everything. So um, yeah, now I'm pretty proud of what I did. And it's kind of a road record, you know, you really don't have in cycling, but it's like, okay, I'm the only one for the moment who did it. So it's something special for sure. I'm also super proud of, about this uh, three world titles uh, jersey because Since I'm young, I can't choose really like my favorite disciplines. So I start with the road cycling after cyclocross, after MTB. And at one point, everyone was asking me to choose one discipline. And I was not able because I think I just love cycling and I love cycling with so many different ways. And winning these uh, three world titles was for me like, okay, I. I did it, you know, and I proved to people that, yeah, I was right to don't make choice. What uh, I did, what I wanted to do, and I think it was a good lesson, like just to to believe in uh, in myself and to to continue and to to just enjoy like riding my bike. Uh, it start. It was uh, in 2016 with the unicorn logo, and yeah, just find it cute and just wanted to keep it but I feel bad now because it's not a story about the unicorn logo <laughs> yeah yeah maybe with the stripes on it and but it's cute no yeah it's cute I like okay. it I love it thank you <laughs>
it's always nice to see this picture because it was the first time as I was uh, I was wearing the jersey, so it's it's quite cool. Becoming a Grenadier in last year in November was like yeah, just such a dream. Yeah, I'm feeling really proud to be part of uh, the Grenadiers team, and I think it's the first team you know who really understand me. With this team, you know, it's such professionals that. I feel I'm I'm really part of the team and we are on the same page. So, um, yeah, I'm really lucky, I can say. So, yeah, I have a tattoo in the neck, life is a joke. Um, I made it just after um, my second surgery because I had two times surgery uh, in my iliac artery. So, um, I had quite a hard time, you know, after these uh, three world titles because I was suffering the left leg and we didn't really know what was happening to me. Yeah, after that I said, wow, it was like really tough and but I always kept, you know, pushing and believing that I would be able to come back. So I make this tattoo just to say, okay, you know, it's life is a joke, so everything can happen and it will be always all right and you have to take the positive in every situation and um, yeah just yeah give your best and uh, yeah be always believe in yourself yeah for sure i'm really happy so far with uh, my equipment for bio racer and yeah i feel like uh, really comfy and um, also feel fast you know also in training, it's important to, to have good sensation, good feeling. So yeah, I really like my kids. Can I open? Oh, it's cool. Oh, it's super nice. So here you can count how many world titles I have. This sounds a bit like uh, pretentious, no? <laughs> It's cool. With life is a joke. My logo. It's really nice. I like it. <laughs>